Hey, welcome back guys. It's me again, Mr. 4 k Upscaler. This video is just me trying to help out fellow subscriber. He's been having some issues with his PlayStation 4 Pro. Uh, he has same TV, just a different model, but it's the same exact TV. It's a nine, I believe it's a 9,000 he's got, and I got 8,000. They're not that much of a big difference between KS9000 and 8000. The only difference you will notice is the cosmetics uh, that uh, 9000 has. But pretty much everything else, it's similar. You know, I just want to point that out. I know mine is KS8000, he has 9000, but it's not that much of a huge difference. Okay. Now, let me tell you what he He sent me a message on PlayStation Network. Uh, and he's asking basically if I can help him with this issue. Uh, what he's got is, let me just tell you what the problem that he's facing with his PlayStation 4 Pro. So I'll just read it for you. Uh, whenever he launches a Grand Theft Auto 5 game and other titles that are similar resolution, which is CUH 7000, everything from 2013 all the way to 2015, uh, CUH 7000 model PlayStation 4 games they were being released on that system okay so that's what he meant uh, he's not talking about patched up PlayStation 4 Pro games okay and we all know Gran Turismo I mean Grand Theft Auto 5 it's not patched up pro game so uh, whenever he launches the Grand Theft Auto 5 game uh, resolution on PlayStation 4 Pro drops the text on the system user interface becomes more grainy and he says from what he can see it appears that older games at 1080p or lower resolution when launched take over the system whole resolution so basically what he sh what he wants me to do is to see if my console and my TV have the same issue so that's what I'm gonna do here I'm trying to do a test to see if my console and my TV will have that same issue. It could be that maybe his TV is having some issues. You know what I mean? It could be that maybe his PlayStation 4 Pro is having some issues. So what I'm trying to see is for him to see if this problem is universal or is it just something that he's got on his console. So that's what I'm going to try to do here. Now the game I'm going to be testing this on, it's not going to be Grand, uh, Grand Theft Auto 5 because I don't have it on but what I'm gonna be testing it on is this game right here okay I'm gonna be testing it on uh, Dirt Rally now Dirt Rally it's an older PlayStation 4 game it's not a patched up pro game even though it uses as PlayStation VR so I'm gonna go ahead and start Dirt Rally okay here we go And then after that, I'm going to see if the resolution or if the text gets all messed up. So there it is. Okay. So far, I'm not having any issues. Okay, it's loading a save data. But I'll tell you what, this is what I'm going to do right now. Let me check and see what the resolution is right now. Let me check, click PlayStation. And let me see what the resolution says on there. Okay, it's a UHD 3840-2160. So this is being upscaled. All right, so this is now being upscaled. Uh, it's an upscaled resolution, 4K. Let me check and see. Yeah, I see right there it says 38. Let me adjust my low light. Sorry about that, guys. Let me just adjust my low light a little bit here. Uh, that's better. Here we go. Now, let me go ahead and let me check and see if there's any issues here. See, I'm not having any issues. All right, that's just one game I tried. Let me try another game. Let me try uh, Yakuza 0. Let me see if Yakuza 0 is going to do this same issue. Okay, so I'm starting a Yakuza 0 right now just to see. 
uh, if ever. Because remember, these are the old games. This is not a PlayStation 4 uh, patched up game. He just wants me to test this on a older PlayStation 4 games. I know it's it's a newly released game, but still, it's not a PlayStation 4 Pro game. Okay, that's what I'm trying to tell you. Okay, so here's Yakuza 0. I've started Yakuza 0. Now, let me go to the menu, see what happens. By the way, it looks pretty good, man. On Because uh, this is upscaled. Remember, guys, this is being upscaled, and this is how you know it's being upscaled. There it is. Click on it, and you'll see what it says on there on the top. Uh, UHD 3840 2160 so you know this game is being upscaled now I don't see any issues here I don't see any problems um, Golden Boy double X that's his name what I would do if I was you okay let me exit here this is what I would do let this game run let it run I'm not gonna turn that off let it run what I would do is this just follow these steps uh, I'm trying to help him here just go right here Go to your uh, sound and screen, go to the video output settings, and uh, keep everything, and I do mean everything, keep everything on automatic, and check your uh, uh, input information. You see, when you keep it on automatic, it automatically decides whether to use uh, YUV or RGB. The reason it's using RGB now is because the game doesn't support HDR. So, it's using RGB. I wouldn't mess with YUV 420. Don't mess with that. Leave everything on automatic. And I think that could be the reason why you're seeing that problem. Because you have your UHD color on, and then you are switching. See, if I switch to YUV, then there'll be... Then it's going to think... Okay, let's, let's try this. Look what happens. You see what happens? Hold on, I'll show you. See, when you do that, you might have some problems when, you, when you're when switching it to that kind of locked-in resolution. So I wouldn't do that. You see? So what I would do if I was you, I would just simply do this. Uh, this, this is something you should try. Uh, I think this could work. Try this out. And let me know how it goes. Hold on. Go to the uh, sound and screen and keep it on automatic. Just so you guys know, YUV 420, it's for HDR. It's for the 10-bit color televisions that support Y-Color Gamut HDR. So if you are running HDR, it'll show YUV 420. If you're running just a regular uh, 4K, it will show red, green, and blue, okay? Which is the standard, red, green, and blue. So YUV 420 and 422, it's HDR. So I just want you guys to know that. But what I would what I would do if I was you, I would keep everything on automatic, man. Keep everything on automatic. Everything, and I do mean everything. Keep everything on automatic. Everything should be automatic. And another thing I would do if I was you, uh, go to your Grand Theft Auto V. Click option on that app. And make sure you go to uh, information. Click on the information and see what type of version do you have. What sort of version update do you have. And if the game needs the update or not. And also check for updates, okay. When you uh, go to your Gran Turismo 5, check for updates. Go to your Gran Turismo 5 app. When you pop in the disc, when you want to start the game, click on Grand, I mean Grand Theft Auto 5. I'm sorry, Grand Theft Auto 5. Click option and then go to the uh, check for update. Make sure you update that game. Maybe you didn't update it. Try that. But honestly, I think this is the solution. This is the solution. Go to the. Uh, I know I got a few more seconds to go. This is the uh, uh, solution right here. Go to the sound and screen. Go to the video output settings. Keep everything in automatic, man. Keep everything in automatic. And I think this should solve the problem. If, if this doesn't solve the problem, then you might have some issues with your TV. You might have to update your TV. Check your updates on your uh, 9000 series. Okay? Because, uh, cause I don't know. In, in UK, they have different uh, model numbers. So, I don't know. Try to... Uh, update the firmware as well but try this first let me know how it goes man all right hopefully this helps man